Good day everyone, this is Maggie B for Apps for iPads and today we're taking a look at a universal app that you can use on your iPad, your iPhone, and your iPod Touch. This is called iRadio. Now when you first come into the application you are going to be greeted once you've picked out some favorites with those favorites and I did that because, you know, it's really easy to find top 40 hits. It's not so easy to find some of the other things that we might like to listen to now and again. I happened to dance to Argentine tango, so I wanted to see if there was anything from South America and Buenos Aires in particular that I could find that I could listen to. And while I didn't find the exact type of music that I normally like to dance to, I like the Nuevo style, not the traditional so much, I was able to find some channels, some radio channels, and I'll show you exactly how I did that. I came into all genres, and I went to search. And I typed in tango and was greeted by all these tango stations from around the world. I could have also gone to the world by country, gone to South America, Argentina, Buenos Aires, and then just... See, they like rock and roll too. They actually like Nuevo Tango, but it's harder to find than traditional. Oop, that one failed streaming. But with 30,000 plus radio stations, you're not going to be bothered by one once in a while. You're going to find one that's not going to play. There's plenty more that you can um, access. You can explore through different genres within a country, the stations within a country. You can back up and instead of by country, I can go by local and it's using my GPS and it's telling me exactly what's playing right now. If we come back here and I go to all genres and I pull it down for the search and I type in, say, another one that's very difficult to find is children. You can find some that way. Or I can go through... this way, all genres. You can do it by decade or you can do it by letter. You can scroll through like this or you can hit the letter on the side, find children's music. I found it very difficult to find children's music, especially lullaby music, to be able to play uh, to the kids when they went to bed. You know, top 40 is easy. This isn't so easy. Here's lullaby tunes. We can do kids tunes. Who doesn't love Sesame Street? Listen. Radio Disney. So this is a wonderful tool that you can have with you. You can see that there's all sorts of things. You can do book reviews. Oh, no, no, nothing on right now in book reviews. Can you Caribbean music on a summer afternoon? How about Radio Margaritaville? It's good. Thirty thousand plus radio stations for you to choose from, and you can use it on any of your iOS devices. And I want to show you one last thing, which is absolutely wonderful. If you don't turn off the streaming, you can change to whatever you're working on. And back. And it plays the entire time. If you tap in the upper right hand corner, it'll tell you exactly what is playing. You can stop the stream. You can add it to your favorites. You can share your station by email, Facebook, and Twitter with your friends. It gives you a little bit about 
the station. It gives you the web page if they have one. It will take you directly to their web page right within the application. And it tells me that if I like that station, I might like some of these other ones too. So there you have it, iRadio for your iPad, iPhone, and iPod Touch. This is Maggie B. for Apps for iPads. Join us on the website where we'll have our full review. See you on that website where we'll sync with you soon.